What is going on guys? My name is Ron back again from Round Reviews here with another episode of reaction of The Rising of the Shield Hero Season 3, Season 2, Episode 3. Words. <laughs> uh, apologies for, one, my little bit tardiness that I am today. I happened to take a shower right after work, which was a pretty early day. I went in at midnight, worked a 10 hour shift, so I got off at 10. Uh, and then I basically took a shower and knocked out. Woke up probably a few, probably about half an hour ago. So yeah, that's why I look like this. Hair's all down and stuff. Uh, normally I would just go straight to recording right afterwards, but apparently my body had different plans. But yeah, uh, yeah, I'm ready to jump into this episode. Hopefully you guys are too. But yeah, without further ado, let's jump in to the third episode of Rise right, of the Shield. Let's start in three, two. One, let's jam. Spirit tortoise. Mm -hmm. CGI is a little rough on that. Oh, uh, so this is going to be an actual fight. This is actually going to be a really good, like... Action episode. Good. I knew like the last few episodes are technically more set up, so I'm really excited we're finally getting to the meat and bones of some of this. It's what I've been looking forward to. Shaking Land, episode three. You know, I, I know this is a fantasy world. I'll never understand the name Melty to this day. Interesting interaction. Good, I want to see a proper battle scene. Shouldn't they technically be in front because they have the shields? Or are they sending out the dragon riders first and then... I, okay, I don't know. So they send the dragon riders out. No, oh, nice. They're going to be, like, inspired. It's like, oh, it feels good to be, like, the source of a rallying. Yep. 
like big Far Cry from the original, like the in the first season. Oh, that's right. They see the flag. They're like back, back off. Are they gonna use the ray shield again, or is he gonna use the ray shield? Intro. Okay. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Good. I think that was my biggest gripe because I'm only watching two other shows right now, Kaguya and Spike's Family. Um, I haven't felt a lot of filling yet. I felt like there was a lot of stuff I was still craving more of. Like, whether it be action or more exposition. Some, something. I was craving something. And I'm hoping this is going to be the episode where I'm like, yes, Shield Hero. Another uh, commenter recommended I look at another show. Um, I think it was actually on my Rise of the Shield Hero uh, reaction, so I'll probably check it out. Um, just, you know, with work being pretty busy with things going on. Um, I had to take a little bit of priority with that, so. These three shows have been perfect. If I hit another sort of show, depend especially depending on the time and day, um, it might throw a wrench into things, but we'll see, we'll see. Never say never. I just realized that, so somewhere in this intro, it's showing that the other three heroes are like, getting messed up. But now Fumi wasn't part of it, so. I wonder what other OP shields he's going to unlock this season. They're gonna, they're gonna take one side off, hey, one side completely. Oh, he generated hate. That's such a pretty funny. I play a, a game called New World, and that's pretty good. Basically, it's a, it's a taunt. Brings all the attention to him. I mean, he is the tank. Ballistas, catapults. I have a feeling all that stuff is going to just do nothing to it. It's just going to bounce right off of it. Yeah, I was going to say, as if you were the only one to say that, they're not going to hear that. <laughs> At least they passed it down. Something like Original soundtrack. Is that an incantation? That seems slightly overpowered. Jeez, OST is OP. <laughs> Always will refer to her as old lady. 
But if you notice, she like she like almost like went. So I wonder if it's like causes a big drain. Yeah, it's just gonna. Bro, you you're missing all your shots. Okay, there you go. You fucking what, mate? Keep firing, you know? Huh. It's like they disappear. Disappear after being defeated. I mean, that's smarter if you put all of your, uh, put all of your focus on one little section should probably like do some damage. R.I.P. Damn. Oh, well, it stopped it, so they did, actually did something. Well, all right, so they stopped it, so... Is it like covered in rocks? Yeah, rubble. Oh no, maybe it's just wounded enough? Yeah, this is too easy. I mean, that's its tail. Raftali gonna be the one to do it? No. What if it's Rush um her? Oh, well, shit. You probably, you know, don't, don't look. Damn. Uh, hopefully they don't get caught in it. even stronger than it was before if it continues just to keep on launching it.
Oh, uh, if you get up close and personal, yeah. They're going to die regardless, basically. Sorry if I'm not talking too much, I'm just really like just focusing. Yep. He's just walking past all of your comrades, just dead. They're gonna bombard the area. Dude, imagine one of the thorns just hits in the middle of that area and they're all gone. Because they're all clumped up. She's got to play a bigger role, so I feel like this can't just be the end. Some like zombie come here and look at me. Basically, don't have time. So she's constantly like. Whenever it, it's taking a toll out of her. I mean, maybe we might actually see the end of this. It just, it seems so early. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was like, that's in like the one, yeah. But it just pierces the skin, Is that, unless that's what they're trying to do. Oh, so now that there's an actual hole, maybe they can cut off? Since at least the skin's open, therefore the armor. I don't think it's going to be enough. It's cutting it, but I, I feel like it's not going to be enough. It's not going to cut it off completely.
You can tell I get taking a giant toll on her. Oh damn. Okay, okay, maybe. They did it. Wow, I had a feeling this would have probably lasted a little bit longer, though. Words taken before disaster, watch. I mean, we're almost to the end of the episode. I, I just kind of feel like this arc should have been a little bit longer than three episodes, if this is the actual end. They paid attention to her for a minute. She seems familiar. I wonder if she was a character from the first season. Did she just disappear? Okay, no, no. Did she just lose her powers? Did she just lose her powers? Or did she just lose her memories? Okay. If that was only, like, one of them, what if... What if... Imagine if that's like well, there's that was just one of its little like things, and there's a giant actual like tortoise that's the real one, and they just sends out like small little like, pawns just to collect souls. If I'm right, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> but I had a feeling I was like, this is too easy. I think that there has to be more to it. They're setting up too much of a big arc for that. So yeah, makes a lot more sense. Okay. Yeah, because, like, I'm pretty sure if the spirit thing go, the spirit towards goes away, she goes away, too. I think that, that was, like, pre-established. Are we going to get into the scene, or is it just going to get right there? Ruins in the fog. Okay. Okay. I was glad. I was really hoping that we didn't actually just end the actual arc just like that. I actually would have been a little bit disappointed. But now that we know that there's going to be a lot more coming, at least I think so, um, I don't think we're going to get anything action-related in the next episode because we got so much of it in this one. So... It's probably going to be a lot of exposition, a lot of lore building even more, and then going on, what do we do next? But yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode reaction. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments section below. And as always, I will see you guys next time. See ya.